microphone is. So I'm not screwing this up. <laughs> I'm going to risk another live even though these things seldom work. And there's usually a boat that's going to ruin your uh, audio. Cheers everybody. It's the end of the day. Oh, that's so good. I won't talk while this boat is going. I'll just show you this. Yeah, awesome, huh? Clothes are dirty. My back is sore. The beer tastes good. And I am at uh, Glades Boat yeah, Boat Storage. Oh my god. It's been a long day. Alright, hold on. Can you hear me? I don't need a Coors Light. I see that. Thank you for subbing, AJ Geek. How's the motors doing? I'll get that. I'll get to that in a second. Okay, audio is good. Audio is great. Right here by the river, Caloosahatchee River. There's a little bit of uh, clouds in the sky. When the sun goes down, it's probably going to be beautiful. Mm. Saw some big alligators today. Big. Big. My sub yesterday. Thank you. Connor, appreciate it. Lucky, lucky man. Yes, indeed. I was just sitting on the dock, leaning with my back up against the pylon, and I, I thought I had to share it, despite how terrible the lives are sometimes. This is such a great place. People are so professional, clean. This is a working boatyard. This is a non-paid advertisement for people who deserve it. People who are uh, passionate about their jobs. Yeah. Is that backwards? It might be backwards, I don't know. I don't know how this social media stuff works. <laughs> You can see that thing in the background? Y'all know what that is? Not backwards. All right, cool. That's correct. I'm learning as you learn. <laughs> Boat lift, that's correct. This is the one that pulled me out. The good thing about lives is that you get to see things as they're happening. This is me drinking a beer right now, right in front of the lift. Contiki came into this basin. And the machine that I'm walking under right now lifted my boat out of the water. First time ever. Shuttle launch. <laughs> kind of felt like that. I just walked through that machine. An incredible device. You might recognize this boat. And uh, the part you don't recognize, me neither, is this part here. Not too bad either. Not too dirty. It's good. Uh, you know what? I was going to show you the motor. The motor got pulled today. The motor uh, is in the back of Mike's trailer. Um, forgive me, it's in the, his truck. This is his trailer that I'm now sitting in, which is parked right next to Good Times. Getting the dogs on and off the boat has been fun. I gotta take my glasses off to see. Bottom looks great, I think so. I mean, um, I, I always clean it myself and there are huge patches of nothing. No barnacles, over here a little bit, you know? But not bad, it's been a long time, I'm missing a zinc. But uh, everything is solid, the rudders, the strut, propellers, 
all the stuff that makes Kantiki go. I'm happy about that. It gives me an opportunity to mess with stuff like the swim platform here. A little power wash, yeah, that wouldn't be bad. A new motor would be even better. And you can see maybe there's a stanchion that's usually there. We took that out today. They picked it up with a forklift. I've documented everything. I'm very behind on the videos, believe it or not. I mean, I'm trying my best tonight. It's been a long day. Mike picked me up. You know what? I'm going to walk back down to the water. I've been looking at the boat all day long. I want to see the water. Dry dock, blades, boat storage. How long is the motor going to take? We're going to pick it up tomorrow, hopefully. I see somebody say they have $250 towards it. A lot of people have committed. You guys are fantastic. Blades, no glades, glades with a G. <laughs> Pups are doing good. They're on the boat. Saffinger's koozie somebody got today. That's pretty awesome. Dude. There was just a big swirl right here. Oh my gosh. How about this teak boat in the background? Don't smoke dope. Don't don't do drugs, kids. Drugs are bad, okay? What else have we got? Time for a beard? No, 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 no. There's another. That is a cool boat. Hello from Sweden. That is a. It's a freaking pirate boat. This place. I should wait a line. Uh, maybe after the live. So that you can't see me get skunked. Um, I gotta read some comments. I smell a campfire going right now. It's so nice. Mike is on good times right now. Uh, the motor we pick up tomorrow. The beer is delicious. Uh, we're gonna pick it up and drive it back and hopefully get it back in the boat tomorrow. We're putting in one motor and I'm running 350s. Where do I sleep? I sleep on the boat. The legend lives. You know what's funny is that the boat is no longer in the water and the water is probably 60 degrees or so and it kind of insulates it from the cold. Last night was 36 degrees here. A little cold, a little cold for my uh, Florida blood. And when the boat is out of the water, there's air underneath that. It was 30 degrees, so it seemed a little colder last night. But I have the sleeping bag. EMS call. Oh, man. Sorry, Todd. <sighs> the sleeping bag was fantastic, Rich. Thank you. Almost too warm. I don't want to turn on Super Chats yet. You know what, you guys? Um, if I can address the people who have contributed towards the motors that the motor um, you guys are fantastic and I've received I feel like as much as I can uh, honestly ask for so uh, I'll, I'll there'll be other things in the, in the future you guys can help me out with but for now I feel like a contented man what about the lock oh my god two locks I went through two locks by myself and I made it I'm still alive uh, I'm working on, uh, I put a video out today, actually, about one of them. That worked out pretty good. The next one I had to do by myself. It's pretty gnarly. Please get a shout out. Mason, there you go. Thank you for watching. Thank you for commenting. Ken Barain, I see you on there. Thanks for all your help, man. Somebody asked, is that all I drink is Bud Light? Well, I don't know how to sip. To me, it's always like, gong, gong, gong. Mm. it's so delicious. Can you imagine if I did this with rum? I would fall asleep in an ant pile and I would be covered in boils or something. See you soon, buddy. Yes, sir. Can I say your name? Let's see it. You're going by too quick. Shrimp and noodles. <laughs> selling the old motor? No, but I got to turn it in as a, um, a core charge because the, uh, the new motor. I'm getting for like less than 2,000 bucks plus this and that and the other thing and uh, stout supporters yeah you know it's kayak seven seas I see you 
again, you know, if I if I drink too much Guinness, I'm I'm chum in the water, and not the good way either. How much is a new boat? I don't know. I would I can't afford a new boat. <laughs> I'm looking at the comments as they scroll past. Um, minus 15 degrees Celsius. Oof, good grief, man. It's funny, you know, in Florida, not only have I worked on rooftops in that terrible sun for 10 years at least, makes my blood very thin, but it's also very humid here, which makes it uh, terribly um, cold. It, it chills your bones. Last November, I went to Montreal to see my friends at Pelican, and I got off the plane in Montreal, and it was it was cold. There was there was snow on the ground everywhere, and I had the um, like a, a very light jacket on. And I, you know, waited outside. And my friend picked me up, and I was okay. I was freaking freaking out. So for this Florida boy to be up in Montreal, not too bad. I, and I sympathize for everybody, all my friends who are showing me pictures of snow up in New York. Oh my God! <laughs> like I just seen somebody in Charleston. Is it? Christian from New York, make some igloos, make some snow, snowmen. In the meantime, I'll watch the sunset. Dude, fish are busting all over the place. I've seen a lot of glittery bass boats here. People, I've actually seen people catch bass too. It's a shame I've been so damn busy. But, uh... That's how you got to do it. You got to stay diligent and keep going, keep driving, keep moving. Cast! <laughs> I know, I know. I don't even have a rod in my hand. Oh, my God. All right. This is getting on. Um, somebody says living large, and I feel like I am with very little. With just me, my boat, which is my home on the Caloosahatchee River. I'm going to sleep on the boat tonight, just me and the dogs, but I don't feel alone because I feel like all of you guys are with me. Maybe I'll continue some editing and get another video out for you guys soon. Any good comments out there? Something from Moorhaven? Hey, was hello from Moorhaven. Ready to get pumped, man. Mm, I'm ready to have two motors again. Tired of limping along. I'm ready to get back underway with a vengeance. Thank you guys for coming along for this live. Stay tuned. I'll give you more as soon as I can.